What's going on, sports gamers? Mike Straw, managing editor of Sports Gamers Online here, with some first details about the next installment of the Golf Club. Sort of. 2K Sports announced on Wednesday the upcoming release of PGA Tour 2K21, which was formerly known as the Golf Club, but it's been rebranded by 2K. Now, no other details of the game have been announced, but 2K is promising more information on May 14th. Now, before getting into the teaser trailer and going over a couple things we saw in it, let's talk about the name change. As far as it goes, the game has been rebranded by 2K in order to give it a more recognizable name to the consumers. Titling the game PGA Tour 2K21, as opposed to the golf club featuring the PGA Tour again, was done to also showcase the new features that are going to be coming to the game this year, which will include a much larger PGA presence than the prior installment. But don't get worried about development and anything like that, the game has been in development since 2018, and HB Studios, the team behind the previous golf club titles, are still the studio developing the games. PGA Tour 2K21 is going to launch on the Xbox One, PS4, and Nintendo Switch, but there's been no confirmation regarding a PC release of the game, or the status of the game on the next-gen Xbox Series X and PlayStation 5. So that's all we know about it right now, but what we're going to do is dive into the trailer itself and see if we can spot some things and maybe speculate on what we're going to get here. So first we'll play the trailer in its entirety, and then what we're going to do is go over some things we see in it. So it's not really that long of a trailer, it's only about 17 seconds, but there's still plenty to digest here with what we see. First, you can already tell it's going to have TPC Sawgrass as we've come to expect. It's going to have the Players' Championship based on the flags and the signs around. There's one thing that's really kind of interesting to see, and it's right here, it's a very blurry screen zooming out, but and this is just speculation, there's no confirmation, it's just what I kind of think or what I would like to see announced when more details come out, is that based on the red shirt, the black pants, it would be nice if this was sort of a teaser of Tiger Woods' involvement in the game, or at least as a playable character. It's unlikely, due to what he would cost as a license, because of the fact that golfers usually are licensed on an individual basis for these video games, It'd be surprising to really see him in the game, but with a publisher like 2K behind the new golf game, it wouldn't surprise me at all, really, to see them fork over the money to get a name like Tiger Woods in the game, knowing how much that would sell if they promote PGA Tour 2K21 featuring Tiger Woods. Tiger Woods hasn't appeared in a video game since he left EA Sports years ago, and it would be a nice sort of treat for players to be able to play as one of the greatest golfers, if not the greatest golfer of all time. We do know that the gameplay, based on the swing and things of that nature, is going to be similar to what you've seen in the past as far as visuals and things like that for past golf club titles. But real quick, can we talk about the height of this tee shot for an iron? Maybe he wants to sky it, but it's really hard to understand why anybody would want to tee up a shot this high. Now if we keep looking at this, we zoomed in here a little bit, you can see in the bottom right corner there's Under Armour equipment. Now if this is supposed to be Tiger Woods, likely it's not, again speculation. It would probably be Nike unless they don't have any Nike equipment within the game. Also if you look at the skin tone, it kind of looks on the lighter side, so it might be Patrick Reed who also does the black pants red shirt on the course. We'll see what happens, we'll see who else is within the game as far as licensed golfers, but we do know there will be more licensing within this year's game as opposed to the Golf Club 2019, and that includes more licensed courses, which is what everybody's been concerned about. So sports gamers, it's only a little bit, it's only 17 seconds to look at, but there's some things to take away from here, but now I want to pass the question off to you. What do you think about the upcoming release of PGA Tour 2K21? What are you hoping to see in the game as far as courses or licensed golfers or features? Let us know in the comment section below, 
and don't forget to leave a like on this video, subscribe to Sports Gamers Online, and turn on your notifications so you never miss any of our latest videos, and stick with SGO for more information on PGA Tour 2K21 as it becomes available.